It has been a busy day for advocates rallying to try to get various bills passed before New York State's legislative session ends on Thursday. Our Capitol correspondent Karina Capabianca walks us through some of those proposals as we enter the final countdown. With a Thursday deadline looming, progressive advocates say the time is now to pass clean slate legislation. It would seal old conviction records for New Yorkers who have already served their time. Formerly incarcerated New Yorkers say it would help them secure employment. I'm 71 years old. I'm not ready to sit down and wait for a Social Security check. I want to work. I got a lot to give. Activists are also supporting parole reforms like elder parole. People over 55 years old who have served at least 15 years in prison would get an automatic parole hearing. Tombstone signs were put up in West Capitol Park to symbolize New Yorkers who have died while incarcerated. At 21 years old, I came home from prison. The woman I left behind there, whose name is Linda, made a birthday cake for my 21st birthday. That was over 20 years ago. She's still there, languishing, over 70 years old. Republican lawmakers have spoken out against these policies, instead wanting reforms to bail reform laws. But the Senate and Assembly both have Democratic supermajorities. We just see it's a continued step in the wrong direction. It seems amazing to me while we have this spike in crime that they're talking about more soft on criminal type legislation. Another rally was held to push for the New York for All Act, which would limit state and local officers from working with ICE and sharing information with the agency. In Albany, Karina Capabianca.